it's Chris. I just got my Revel Point Metro X scanner and I want to review some of the accuracy claims that they have. So let's take a look. If you look at the Metro X user guide, it says that its um, volumetric accuracy is 0.03 millimeters plus 0.1 millimeters for every meter in length. I did a uh, YouTube video about three years ago when the pop first came out looking at the stitching error and uh, it turned out that over a one and a half meters there was over a 15 millimeter deviation from what it was supposed to be. So I'm going to repeat the test with the with the Metro X. I've got my plate glass with reflective targets on it and I'm going to first do a global marking with the Metro X and then I'll do different scans. I'm going to create a new global marker scan here and hit start and then I'm going to slowly move the tripod down the glass plate and it's going to collect all the uh, markers so that we know where they are. Now in full field mode, we're going to move down and collect the actual scan data. Next we're going to fuse the data together and then we're going to mesh it. And then finally we're going to export the STL file. We're going to load the mesh into Polyworks. And it's millimeters, so we have this nice long scan of data. And we're going to just create a plane out of the first little part of the scan. And then we're going to best fit a plane to it. Now we're going to expand the plane so that it actually encompasses the whole scan. So we're going to measure from the primitive. So we're going to go from the plane. We're going to go to all the points in the mesh. And we'll measure. So the scan data is roughly 1600 millimeters from end to end. And it's about 192 width. And it looks like at the end of the thing, it's about six millimeters off the plane. Well, the six millimeter error at 1.6 meters is much better than the 15 millimeters that the pop had, but it's still nowhere close to what the uh, spec said for accuracy. Well, if this was helpful, please hit like and subscribe and have a great day.